Steve Smith here with TrueHotToEat.com. Happy Thanksgiving. Um, got a couple of days off from work. Uh, my mom is actually in town visiting. Uh, we're in the middle right now of uh, actually preparing our Thanksgiving dinner, so I figured what better time than, than right now to prepare a little uh, Thanksgiving uh, Too Hot to Eat creation. So um, what I'm going to do here is something a little weird. I've got a... Okay, my mom wouldn't let me do the whole bird, so I stole a couple of little pieces off here. I uh, figured nobody would miss these. So uh, I'm just going to get right to it. I uh, don't have a lot of time here. Okay, I'm going to just take one of these pieces right here. Okay, just a little slice off of it, off of the main bird. I'm going to drop it in here. I've got some of this, uh, some of this sauce that we got. It's uh, basically just a buffalo wing sauce. I'm going to pour that on top of it to baste it in there for a minute. Just kind of flip it around and get it all over. Okay. Well, this stuff puts off quite a scent. It's got a, got a smell to it here. Okay. Now I'm just going to let that sit in there for a minute while I do this part. Okay, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to take some breadcrumbs, okay, got some uh, cayenne pepper, I want to be sure and get plenty of that in there, this kicks it up several months right there, crushed red pepper, yeah, alright, I'm going to put a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, Alright, I got this guy out of the backyard. I was showing you this the other day. This is one of those habanero peppers that I got growing out back. And this one looks perfect. So we're going to put that on there. Now normally, when I do something like this, I like to cut these things up really coarse. But this one is a little bit different. Since we're going to be putting it in a, in a breading like this, we want to chop it up really fine so that it'll... Uh, so that it'll stick to the turkey. So this is uh, a little bit different than normal. But you want to chop it up as fine as you can possibly do. Alright, I think that'll probably do it. Start chopping, you can really smell the cubes coming right out of the pepper. I'm just going to put those right in there. Alright, there we go. Just going to kind of toss it around in there a little bit just to mix everything together. I'm going to add one more thing to this. This is, uh, got this stuff from Williams Sonoma. It's like a spicy chipotle rub. It's good. Gonna put that in there just for a little extra. Mm. Okay. Once you got all that mixed together, then I'm just gonna take our slice of turkey here and just roll it around in here. I'm gonna be sure to get plenty of those uh, habaneros up on top of there. This is really gonna kick it up a notch. Oh, hey. What are you doing in here? You know I'm trying to put that in there. <laughs> <laughs> we got something. You might need that. Oh, thank you. I'm just going to bathe this stuff around in here. What have you done to my turkey? It's just a little piece. Of a little piece. You ruined the whole thing. You'll never miss it. Trust me. It's, it's going. Everything's good. All right. Nobody's going to be able to eat that, Stephen. Mm. Too hot to eat my foot. It's more like too crazy to think. <laughs> I'm almost done, okay? Alright. Now, I got this rolled in there really good. Mmm, that is perfect right there. Okay, I'm going to take this and just lay it on a pan like that. I got a couple of chunks of habanero in here that I don't want to go to waste, so I'm just going to kind of lay those on top there. Oh, uh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. And I 
think we are ready to bake. Okay, I'm just gonna, all our ovens are occupied right now with turkeys and stuff, so I'm just gonna do this right in the toaster. I'm just gonna put it in here. 350, bake. I'm gonna go for about 30 minutes. Okay, now, this is the part, boys and girls, where you pretend like there's some kind of space warp or something going on. Um, since I don't have 30 minutes to film, I actually got one of these that I've made earlier and it's already in the oven and it should be done right about now. So I'm going to go ahead and, and I'll pull that out. Oh yeah. Perfect timing too. Look at that. It's then gotten all golden brown on the top. There we go. Okay. Careful, the pan ain't the only thing that's hot here. All right, this looks great. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a give this a try. Mm. Wow, never had buffalo turkey before. Pretty good. So wow, it's really got a quite a kick to it actually too. Okay, I'm gonna give this <coughs> about. Seven and a half peppers on the too hot to eat burnometer scale. Um, this probably isn't going to become too many people's uh, Thanksgiving tradition. I think after after getting a, a taste of this today, though, it might become a new tradition for me. But um, for most Thanksgiving spreads, this is going to be way too hot to eat. 